so many people that I, I lost contact with and we kept, you know, we, we started getting back to the same situation. Where am I getting to? All meeting with these people brought out a new dimension, which is what gave birth to tales of our legends. I decided to tell stories about our people, not just musicians, not just artists, but people that have made a difference in our country. I looked at big stars that are fading away hungry, some of them begging to eat food, and I'm like, what? How come nobody knows about these people? How come this story is not being told? How come it's not being documented? I see a lot of big stars these days. I see people like Tim Meyer, uh, David Doe, uh, Two Face, so many of them. These people that you are seeing today, they are just like the same stars that I started with when I was in the music industry, when I was in the show business. These were big stars. These were mighty stars that sold stadiums, sold arenas, sold, I mean, big stars. But today, many of them are begging to eat. Many of them are begging just to survive, just to get the, just the normal things that people would, you know, the normal things that people get here that we take for granted. I looked at it and I was thinking, I was like, wow, if you go on the street of Nigeria, you ask the kids about who Michael Jackson is, who Lana Richie is, who um, Kim Kardashian, one of, uh, who, I mean, Tupac, and they will tell you the history. They will give you the history. Oh, I know this person, I know that person. But if you ask them about Nigerian stars, who was down Mariah? Who was, uh, who was, uh, so many of them, Sonny Okosun, um, late to Sayomori, um, to, I mean, sadly I'm saying late, this was not too far away, that I just interviewed this general man, a star, now blessed memory. They wouldn't know. Kids don't know anything. They don't know any story. They don't know nothing about Nigeria. They don't know about the history of Queen Amina. They don't know the history about the Dahomey Kingdoms. They don't know the history about how the Nigerian civil war, they don't know anything about the fights to keep us as one Nigeria. Why? Because we forget to tell the story. We forget to tell the story. So we forget to document our history. They said, if you want to make people forget about who they are or to, to, to make people not to know who they are, write books. People don't read. 